How's it going guys, guys, and me pals? I'm Alice in Wonderland, your favorite QA trans girl, and a couple days ago I thought it would be really funny to do something that is objectively about dumb as rocks. You see, I ventured into the unknown jungle of neckbeard parasites known as Reddit to a deep, entrenched community called Roast Me. In search for content, I laid out a net, a trap, I made a post, and I invited them to make fun of me. Because I thought it would be funny. Let me show you some of the most hilariously brutal roasts that came in. Why f around? Let's get started. All right, so this is the post I made. Trans girl here, I'm ready to laugh awkwardly. Bonus points if I haven't heard it before. Posted by my alt account, you slash no honkers sad face. I thought I would post it on my YouTube community as well and invite you to roast me too. Just so that we have a mix of serious and light-hearted roasts. First roast, Hunter Schaefing. Oh, that is clever. Woo! Oh, off to a strong start here. Whoa! I need to add your chin to my tool shed. A tool, huh? Honey, the only thing useful about me is my ability to eat cereal. The face that Alice makes right before pushing the door that says pull. F you, I'm leaving. Asking to be roasted is some serious bottom energy. Bold words from someone who followed my orders. I don't know why, but it seems like a headbutt from you would be particularly painful. That would be because of my sharp wit. Skirt Cobain. <sighs> oh, honestly, I'll just take that. I'll, I'll just take that. I'll accept it. Before we get any further into this video, make sure to like and share it with all of your friends who would find it funny. Not just because it's ridiculously hilarious, but also because I'm a selfish bitch and I want to go viral again. Do it now! That is an order! One day, maybe you'll transition into someone with any sense of taste for interior decorating. <laughs> this is a family heirloom! Don't make fun of it! You are the most willing and yet least capable person to do a cartwheel. I... I am uniquely devastated. Why does that hurt? The outfit with the hair is giving Lorax. Do not say that. No, I'm not the fucking Lorax. I'm not. Girlie's collarbone got that tree root vibe. Why are you looking at my collarbone? Do you want to kiss it? You definitely squirt. I mean, you're not wrong. You look like your brain regularly makes the windows dial up noise. You're so chill, you make ice jealous. That is actually a compliment. I I don't think you fully understood the brief. You're not wearing cat ears. False. You must save a lot of money on lipstick since your upper lip is essentially non-existent. Oh, oh god damn it. Ow. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. They're not even wrong. Look at it, it's not in there. Love the spirit board on your neck. Does it only channel bottoms? I am not a bottom. No. Your hair is the third from last option in every 2000s RPG character creator. Oh. Oh, they don't even have a comeback. Oh. You look like a triple A game designed you. We are heavy hitting at the moment. God damn! Although I do have to disagree with that one because if a AAA game had designed me, they would have probably given me fucking boobs! I'm not salty. Um, you're flatter than New Zealand standing on the world stage. Oh! No! Oh! Don't you. You can insult me, but you do not insult the only country that exists. Oh my. Whoa, that actually went hard! You flatter than New Zealand standing on the world stage! That's fucking savage! Holy crap! Oh my god, that hurt. Ow! Fuck, they are good at the moment! Holy crap, this is brutal! Bonus if you haven't heard it before, how about I love you, Dad? Oh, oh my god! right i was wearing this the whole time i am untouchable i would but roasted and flat chested is a bit too much punishment <laughs> oh yes punish me oh you see you cannot win no matter how savagely you insult me i will always 
come out on top. Are you president of the itty bitty titty committee? Cause you're a shoe in Oh no, my boobs are absolutely tiny. <laughs> you clearly do not own an air fryer. Whoa, there is nothing left of my confidence. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <sighs> uh, I can't really roast you when you look beautiful as always. You are kind of missing the point of this post, but I thank you. A wooga cartoon wolf eyes pop out and my tongue canonically rolls out like a red carpet across the floor. No, you're supposed to roast me, not yourself. Don't embarrass yourself on my posts. Honestly, I can't think of a roast. I started HRT a little over a year ago and frankly, Alice is my transition girl. She looks confident, has amazing style, has a wonderful charisma. To roast her would be impossible for me. That's actually really nice, thank you. Still, like, my buzz is going down. So many of these comments are just really nice. You've somehow managed to fail at being roasted. I know! And there's like five degrees of degradation here. I don't understand what's happening. Let's think about it. I asked for people to degrade me, that's one. I failed at people degrading me, which is humiliating in and of itself. Then people were making fun of me for failing at getting people to degrade me, which is degrading. How deep can the rabbit hole go? It's like three levels of reverse degradation psychology. Anyway, back to normality. You look like someone I'd draw with my left hand. <laughs> I never knew that one could transition from horse to human woman. Almost. Good job! Listen, I am not a horse girl. I'm a cat girl at a stretch, but I am not a furry. And you can't ride me unless you're particularly tall. That's what would happen if you tried to ride me. I would kick you. Do your balls swing in a dress? Or do you tuck and roll? Ha! <laughs> Get a load of this, loser. He doesn't know that I've had bottom surgery. My balls are not attached. I've got them and I'm throwing them around like grenades. Alice looks like she went into her emo phase as a teenager and never exited it. That's actually shockingly accurate. Be Alice. Pull hair back only on one side every day. Be Alice. Put on colorful eyeliner every day. Be Alice. Wear cute outfits every day. Be Alice. Wear earrings every day. Wear glasses every day. Be Alice. Consistent. Be Alice. Predictable. Moral of the story? Be Alice. Submissive. I will not stand for this. That is false. And I realize that may be hard for you to understand when I'm standing here in a Don't Bully Me I'll Come t-shirt, but you must remember that I am in control of this situation. I commanded you to roast me. That makes me the dominant. I'm a dominant with a degradation kink. Stealing the name of a famous book but adding a one into it is like parents making up a different spelling of their kid's name to make it unique. Uh, the difference is actually that I'm willingly demented. Places you in a ceramic dish with potatoes, butter, branded spices, then into the oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Oh! I just got roasted! <coughs> I have actually been screaming so much that my throat is hurting. Welcome to the Alice in Wonderland Halftime Show! I'm your host, Game Show Alice, and today I'm going to suck balls for you. On camera. My god! Today we're going to be playing a game of Paper, Scissors, Rocks. We go on rock. Here we go. Paper, scissors, rock. What did you guess? Did you win or lose? If you won, leave a comment saying. <laughs> Special thank you to all of our members, the commissioned officers in my queer army, and especially thanks to our colonels. Your contribution to this army helps maintain order. Thank you to Kelly the Human, to Sarah's Flint, to Third in Line, to Dumb Transbend by the name of Summer, to Bunny Niori, to Herb Evans, to Deanne Kaylee Sayer, and to Ember. Reminder that if you want to support my channel, you can become a member and be a commissioned officer in my queer army, or alternatively, my buy me a coffee link is in the description. Back to your scheduled programming. Why, why hasn't it cut away yet? <laughs> 
Am I missing something? Why is the price tag still on your ear? Those haven't been replaced, right? Or does it show who's your owner, like a cow? No, you don't produce any milk. I'm confused. No. Oh no. No. Please, God, no, do not mention cows in this YouTube channel. But Alice, the people know. The people know what they want. No, stay away from me. I am not a cow. You can't milk me. Not without exorbitant fees. Just go outside. You'll get plenty roasted out there. Correct. I am pale. I literally burn in like 20 minutes. Gonna pull out the big one for this since you're a Kiwi. You look Australian. I'm gonna go find the biggest Nerf gun I own. I'll be back. Say that again, motherfucker! Jesus, why I really is. There are so many Nerf darts on the floor. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand around them. It looks like I'm posing for dominance now. You are a kind and wonderful person who has a positive impact on the lives of those around you. Oh, thank you. Oh, sorry, I thought I was replying to plan a walk, ignore all that. Hey! When was the last time you were able to do even a single push-up? Hmm, I don't know. Let's try this out. Alice in Wonderland push-up challenge. Uh, one, uh, two, three, four, They call me El Macho Libre Fraulein. Here I thought your username was No Hooker's Sad Face, and I was about to get you really excited to look in the mirror. Oh! Whoa! Oh, that's a good one. I just came. Just getting the nerf darts out of the way. 333 comments, zero upvotes. I'm so sorry. Don't be. I see this as an absolute win. What do you get when you order a f doll from Temu? Hey, at least I'm functional. Not emotionally, but physically. You look like you unironically listened to Kevin McLeod. Oh, well, f oh yeah? Oh yeah? Well, guess who's listening to Kevin McLeod now? That's right, Kevin McLeod is playing right now in this video. And the person who made this roast is probably watching, so who's unironically watching Kevin McLeod now? Major appeal for someone dating you would be the fact that they'd never have to meet your parents. <sighs> Woo! Oh, you just got the patented Alice in Wonderland and I Just Came award for good roast. You look like you watch entire shows in a day and bring up the most obscure references at the most inopportune times in conversation. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck you. R slash roast me is full of transphobes and it's so annoying. I posted there a while ago expecting people to hit me with a good roast and I got very few actual creative insults. People just see it as a free pass to be transphobic. It really was. Check this out. Following my post, the mods of r slash roast me had to ban like literally 30 people for breaking reddit terms of service. So I mean, hey, I was doing a service. Those transphobes no longer have an account. But I mean, full credit to the r slash roast me mod team. They were pretty awesome. They were talking to me about it when I told them I was making a video and I would have really liked to get a screenshot of this comment even though it was actually deleted. They went ahead and undeleted it just so that I could take a screenshot. So, props to them. But as you could probably tell, the majority of the roasts from this video did come from my YouTube community. Aside from the one that made me do the original big cum, you know. I've seen better penmanship from a doctor on a roller coaster. Look, have you ever tried riding backwards on your neck? Because, l listen, you gotta, you gotta think of something, okay, right? When you look in a mirror, that shit's flipped, alright? So when you're riding and it looks right in the mirror, it's illegible to anyone that's not looking at you from a mirror. So you have to write it on your neck backwards in the mirror. It's hard. The fact that she pulls her hair back to make it look like an undercut without actually shaving or braiding it makes me feel like she really can't take control like a true dom. Thus, submissive. 
<laughs> I'm not even going to address this. We've talked about this previously. I'm a dominant with the degradation king. I'll punish you for making fun of me, but I will enjoy it. I'll feel bad though. That's okay, you don't have to. Just step out in the sun, it won't take too long. Yeah. Out in the sun for 15 minutes and come back bright red. Uh, you're too tall for most girls to carry to the bedroom. Pfft. It's alright though. As the dom, I'm gonna be the one carrying them. You see my muscles? Like, fuck, I'm ripped. Oh yeah. I don't even do any exercise. Like. Myself. Your car is so broke, it might as well be a Pokemane stand. My car is fine. Don't talk shit about my car. There is nothing wrong with my car. That headlight still fucking works. Okay, don't, don't look at it. Don't, don't look at it. You're into this, aren't you? <laughs> you look like you make good videos, but mine are better. Got him. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Ava. Three people thinking they're original. They're not, of course, and they're also wrong. I heard this from somewhere else, but I still want to say it here. I'm sorry. If you smacked your chest, it would probably sound like a hardwood disc. Oh, it's a f***ing pull door. That's all the roasts I have for you today. Did you count all of the orgasms as they happen? Leave a comment below. I'm kidding, I... That's f***ed, Alice. I didn't actually. If you laughed at this video, you are f***ing legally obligated to like and share it with everyone you know that would find it funny. Not just because it is ridiculously, absolutely hilarious, but also because I am a selfish f***ing and I want to go viral again, okay? I have not had my fill. I need this to keep happening, and I need you to help me with it, all right? That is an order. Share this video now. Anyway, if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. If you want to support my channel, you can become a member and be a commissioned officer in my queer army. I'll remind you as well that I'm now releasing members only videos, so if you want to get access to those, that's how. See you in the next video. Fucking hell, this is a lot of cleanup. I've really made a mess today. And not just in my pants!